Okay, so, um, we're doing that whole cemetery idea thing right now, and, uh, if you could tell, probably not, my GoPro doesn't do very good in low light, so I'm gonna apologize if the video's a little shaky and blurry and whatnot at some points, but, uh, yeah, we're doing this! <laughs> oh, God! The realization of this being a probably really bad idea is slowly setting in the closer I get to this cemetery, which I have told many people about, to not go to at night, especially by themselves. If you couldn't tell, the only thing lighting up these streets are the houses and their lights. By the time I get there, it's going to be pitch black, and I'll probably do a lap around the cemetery and show you guys where it gets real questionable, sketchy, with the urban legends and whatnot. I kind of went into detail about it a little bit in the uh, one of the scariest places to ride to moto vlog that I made a few weeks ago. Yeah, check check that out before you watch this video if you want to see like the uh, the lit up version of where I'm going and whatnot. This place is the real deal, but we out here, the only thing illuminating the streets is my headlamp and oncoming traffic. This is also really scary, not because it's paranormal and then the fact that people have been offed here and unalived and, and you know, spirits have been reported to be seen here, is that brother, this is a very, very high designated state hunting area. This can go south with one deer and I could be roadkill. I'm not gonna think like that because I have happy-go-lucky music going into my ear right now with one earbud out so I can hear my surroundings around me. My head is definitely on a swivel. I adjusted my headlamp up just a little bit so I can get a little more coverage. And uh, yeah, this is uh, this is a little worrisome, I'm not gonna lie, but only like 15 of you wanted this. So hell, we're doing this. I listen to my subscribers. I'm the one that came up with the idea. I'm out here alone like I said I would be. It's getting on nighttime. And oh me, oh my, do I love a good Halloween thrill. So uh, let's uh, let's jump forward just a little bit, and uh, let's go let's go see some spookiness. So I'm gonna pull off to the side a little bit because this is gonna get a little hairy. So in the video, make sure I'm still recording because I swear to God, if my uh, my like recording ends, I'm not doing this again. So this is where it can get real, 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 real fast. So uh, I'm just gonna coast, cause like I said, deer can be a SOB in this scenario. I love that smell of the autumn woods, so I'll tell you that. I am, uh, I am protected in more ways than one. Uh, I have some Trojans on me, just to, just to be safe in case there are any ghosts out here that wanna P. Diddy me. We're not gonna think like that, guys. We're not gonna think like that. This is, uh, I have a feeling this is gonna be not one of my better ideas okay well okay I'm not alone out here I guess this yeah this can get this can get weird so I'm assuming somebody's hunting out here so let's uh let's see what we got going on there is you know, like out of like I'm out of my visor sorry for excessive wind noise but like, even out of my visor, dude, I can't see maybe 50 feet in front of me. It's already that dark. Like, the surrounding trees just make it that much, uh, that much darker. Oh, man. Now, I am aware that this cemetery does have security cameras, like the, the trail cams. And, uh, yeah, this can... So, I, I mean, I'm not going to do anything stupid that's going to get me in trouble, but I'm sure that, you know, a cop comes down and they see my headlamp and be like, yo, it's uh, it's past closing time, so they'll probably kick me out. But I hope they don't uh, trespass me. So, here are the lights. Oh, man. Oh, God. I just, I don't have a good feeling about this, y'all. Here we are. Oh, God. I did it for the gram. Just kidding, not really for the gram. Oh, God. I remember coming here three, four years ago, and it was one of the scariest freaking things that ever happened to me. F 
Well, at least my headlamp looks good. So, uh, we're not fully lights out yet. Oh my gosh. Like, like I said, I got one earbud in right now, so I can't hear if anything happens. I, I'm like looking over, I don't want to say I'm looking over my shoulder, but I'm looking at my rear view just to make sure that the red light is on on my camera. Because like I said, if it turns off, dude, I'm not, I'm not coming back here. <laughs> so over here, you got some rather older graves and whatnot. Uh, I, I think I'm taking the same route that I did with uh, that other video. Don't fucking tell me. That was my fuel light. Oh, bruh. Maybe we're not going to be here as long as I thought we were. Oh, God. I'm only in first right now. I know I've mentioned in other videos that there were uh, two child graves that have many, many reportings on it. And I know it was, it was to my right. Oh, fuck, my fuel light's on. Fucking great. The tree stump back there. So, I'm gonna try and stay on the path here. So, the graves that are get my light on it. The graves that are straight ahead, that is where it can get very, very hairy. It can get hairy, man. Man. This place is creepy at night, man. The woods aren't any fun either. Been back there a couple times. It's these graves where attacks have been reported. Where I've, I've personally heard a blood curling scream. It, it had to have been from an animal or something. And, uh, dude, it, it sent me full on sprinting towards the entrance, man. That's weird. Leaves started falling, and I'm not anywhere near them except that tree. God damn, this is crazy. But it's just like, it's just something straight out of a horror movie, y'all. I know it was oh, like more, it was more like right here where that type of BS took happened. Golly. Like, take a look at that grave over there. Like, it's all decayed and whatnot. You know what's weird? Being back here, where I know it can get really, really sketchy, is the fact that uh, I don't know why I'm feeling incredibly at ease right now. I did not feel this way on the way here. That feeling is slowly changing as we speak. I'm trying to I'm trying to talk so I don't feel as creeped out, but I'm gonna, just gonna get moving. I got a sent a huge sense of fucking dread right now. That like literally just crept up on me. Look at this. It takes a crazy person or a moto vlogger to come to this very, very alleged haunted cemetery at night for his subscribers. <laughs> God. This is weird. I still have my happy-go-lucky music going on in my uh, earbud right now. I don't know, man. Just, like, sitting back there was that... That was a... I felt at ease for a minute, then I felt like a sense of panic coming on. 
like a like an unwanted get out of here feeling. Like I'm not trying to overhype it for the video because I don't, like I said I don't believe in the whole uh, you know step on a twig and go 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 ghost type Scooby Doo esque BS. But uh, all right, I'll do one more lap. I'll make this quick because uh, I'm not trying to get trespassed out of here, nor am I uh, trying to test the light on my gas. Holy shit, it is incredibly warm over here. Like, it was much colder back there, but it's nice and warm over here. Alright, hey guys, so this next part of the video, I can't explain this little light that comes up from the ground and then, like, raises up, shoots off to the left of the screen and has like this little tiny misty trail behind it. I can't explain it. Uh, I'm gonna brighten up the video as much as I can without it being super distorted. Let me know what you guys think or maybe just my mind's playing tricks on me while I'm editing the video. Let me know what you guys think this is in the comments. There is somebody in their grave right now being like, ah yes, a motorcycle rider, fantastic. There is somebody in their grave right now being like, ah, yes, a motorcycle rider. Fantastic. So I think over here there's really no no uh, graves. Well, at least on the left-hand side. Yeah, those woods can get a little, little hairy, so to speak. But we out here. We out here, baby. I do this for you guys. Even though I have an incredible sense of panic right now. Throw that back in my pocket. All right. Probably help if I put it in first. All right, I'm assuming, hoping this is enough footage for you guys because God is this fucking weird. I don't feel very welcomed right now. Haven't, obviously haven't heard anything. This is where all the cre uh, cremation places. Gotta be careful over this. Man, this is freaking weird. All right, I told you I'd do it and I did it. It dark dark now. I hope I didn't upset anybody by coming here late at night. My apologies if I did. I hope you're all resting well. Security cameras in use. God, the things I do for my subscribers. Rest in peace, y'all. Until next time. God loves you. God bless your souls. All right, now comes the next challenge of watching out for deer and traffic. I leave and it's like a huge sense of relief. Alright, good, I'm still recording. Fantastic. I'm sure I'll be able to make it to the to the gas station. It's a ways away, but it'll be alright. With a low gas light, I probably shouldn't have a uh, be on high RPM. I don't know what that truck's doing, but probably camping. Oh, same with them. Yeah, they're camping too. Or they're out hunting, probably ghost hunting too. <laughs> oh man, this is weird. A little on the spook side, you know? I say I can't go too crazy because I got, I, like, this is one of those places where you got to be ready. Especially with a drop off like that. Like, that can get, that can get bad, man. No cars coming, no cars coming. Cool. Yeah, get me the hell, ah, get me the hell out of here. Thank you. No, thank you. I'm, uh, I'm good on all that. I'm good. I am uh, finally, 
I'm good. All right, I'm feeling way more at ease now. Because that was a very, very, very weird feeling. Like, I have never felt so fucking watched in my life. I, uh, I had to get out of that one. That was... Definitely had to get out of that one. That was weird. Very, very weird. And what's funny is what's playing in my earbud right now is, uh... I always feel like somebody's watching me. I know, don't quit my day job. I'm not going to be a singer, don't worry. I'll let you know when I'm on American Idol. <laughs> oh, man. Again, I apologize if the video uh, looks a little cruddy because it doesn't do very good in low light. But next stop is the gas station. Because I probably would have stayed just a little bit longer if my gas light wasn't on. But, uh, I don't know, maybe that was my motorcycle's way of telling me, yeah, dude, you need to get out of here before something bad happens. And I was not disagreeing with my bike, because my bike knows best. That's why you gotta know your motorcycle. Uh, imagine being watched and times that by how many bodies were in that grave. Because, whoa, Nelly, that's, uh, that's weird. That is definitely weird. God damn. It's, uh, I'm trying to shake it off. It's hard. It's weird. God, it's so weird. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, be sure to subscribe to the channel where I post more videos like this and other videos you just might like. As always, support your local veteran. Be safe and ride free. I love you all. Peace out.